Thank goodness it's time to stop for a snack. Oh, Garl, you speak in my language. Not hungry. We just left, I know, but where's time for a snack? Exactly, Garl gets it. <laughs> it's always a, not a real adventure if you don't eat a snack on the road. Hey there, friends, welcome back once again to See You at the Stars with me, Kratos, and no mochi today. As you see, her bed has actually moved. We've put it underneath the desk, but she's downstairs having some lunch. So she's not here right now, but she will return at some point, I'm sure. So last time we made our way into this town and I think it was Garl said that he wanted to head back, try and open some cavern somewhere because of the full moon. Uh, so let's go and, oh my lord, I didn't mean to do that, but that was cool. <laughs> Almost broke my legs. Let's go and see if we can open that. It was somewhere around here. Oh look, that's the book we can use to save. Let's do that. Yeah, why not? Beautiful. Right, so, is this where we want to be? I assume it may be not. Let's keep exploring, see if we can find where we need to go. How is everybody today? Are we all doing good? As you can see, we moved the camera. Last time it was covering up some of the, uh, when we were in battles and things, the hit points, things like that. So we moved that around and uh, yeah, now luckily we can see what we're doing. But I'm just going to do a bit more exploring around here. Hello there, villager. Celestial Willow. It is very cool. Well done, my dude. Um, is there anywhere we need to go? For these things. Go so up here, and it looks like we can head through there in the middle. So let's try that and see where that takes us. I'm going to try something a little bit different today. I really, really appreciate all of the support on episode one. I think some people were really excited about the game. I am also loving it so far, but I'm going to try something that's different to what I would normally do, and that is this whole series. Number one, on my face. <laughs> so that's great. But number two, wow, look at this. Oh, this is funky. There's the Forbidden Cavern. So we can, this, this reminds me of like um, old school Mario Land, or something like that. Anyway, <laughs> I'm not going to be editing these very much at all. I think I mentioned it in last week's, but essentially what I'm going to do is I'm going to push play, record, and we're just going to go for it. Hold up, we can save it again. And I'll always make sure to save. But yeah, we're just going to hit play, we're going to go, and we're just going to see what happens. No planning, <laughs> no scripting, no nothing. We're just going to play the full game, Hardly going to edit it at all so that you can experience the whole thing along with me. But thank goodness it's time to stop for a snack. Oh, Garl, you speak in my language. Not hungry. We just left, I know, but where's time for a snack? Exactly, Garl gets it. <laughs> it's always a, not a real adventure if you don't eat a snack on the road. Garl. Ah, oh, is that a sandwich? Like I said, Mochi's eating her lunch. Maybe I'll have a sandwich once I finish this. No kidding. Sweet, well done, Carl. It's the jam. Oh, you celestial willow jam. Lovely. Okay. Right, let's see if we can open this here. How do we do it? That's a good, good point. I could barely find the place, let alone open it. Open your palm. Okay, we got this. Oh. Hey, moving. Oh, that's going to annoy people. Everyone's going to know we're here now, but it worked. You did it. Well done. Whoop, 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 do a dance. <laughs> well, now, indeed. Yeah, everyone, everyone in the world would have heard that bell. And let's head on in. Let's do it. We're not afraid. Anyone afraid? I'm not. We can do this. Alright, we're in the Forbidden Cavern. Let's see what's around. I love the glowy... Reminds me of Stargy Valley because we've got the 
browsers that glow. <laughs> Little crossover. If you haven't watched Stardew Valley, go and check that out. It's on my channel. Uh oh. Monsters everywhere. And I see a chest. That's good. The only be true for Moon Cradle. Yeah, Moon Cradle was safe. Mm, maybe dangerous. It was fine. We're trapped. Not ideal. But there's three of us and three of them. We can do this. Come on, girl. We're not ready. Yeah, we are. We can do it. Look at them. They're like slugs with spiny things. They're super cool. But there, watch out. Oh, God, I got stabbed in the eyeball. Oh, no. Oh, God. Sacrifice himself. It really hurts. Oh, boy. It's about to attack. Someone needs to do something. Thank you. <laughs> I don't think he's going to be pleased that Garl has missed missing an eye. Nice little shimmy there, Headmaster. Cool. Don't concern yourself. Oh, the poor little Garl. He's crying. He said he'll apply for training, so it kind of worked. Ish. Not sure if that was successful or not. <laughs> because I'm not editing, you can see the true glory of how long these loading screens are. Usually that's the sort of thing I would edit out for you, but not anymore, friends. You've got to suffer if I suffer. Make sure your tree is wound. Verger, understood. You will not see your friend for a very long time. Oh, Garl. I'll see you later, buddy. It takes years to properly train. I'm not going to see him for years? Well, I mean, he's not going to see much with only, you know, his eye stabbed out by a slug. Hopefully he has time to recover. Ay ay ay. Don't forget about me. Guys. Listen. <laughs> we cannot forget about our friend Gar. Okay? Never. So this is the last time we see him and in three episodes time. I've totally forgotten his name. Which is like me. Remind me. Garl. Absolute hero. Take us away, Headmaster. Music. Ooh, magic ball. Cool glow. So, let me get this straight. We just finished a game. Floating castle in the sky. Let's start a new game. Where we are a warrior on a castle floating in the sky. Well, at least we've got a, a theme. <laughs> Careful now, okay. Sorry, I was talking over you. A bad start to our year. Oh, what a view. Oh, we are really going up to the tippity top of the world. Terrified. Welcome to the classroom in the sky. It's beautiful. Being close to the stars helps new recruits acquainted with it. Neat. Neat. Idea how much potential they have. He's saying this out loud. <laughs> how come we can read it? It's in his head. Magic, you will, you will learn how to fight. 
beat up those slugs for attacking our friend Garl. Boeing. <laughs> it's a boring but mandatory. Nice. Alright, we, we. So, we can do things like that. I actually. Some crochet the other day. It's not much. <laughs> it's like a. At some point I'll, I'll show you, but it's essentially, I've made a circle, let's make a line. I don't know how I did it, I think as I got to the end of the line, I sort of ended up curling back on myself and made almost like a coaster. Um, <laughs> it's not what was supposed to happen. It's a thing. Alright, well, let's get sewing. Years and years of sewing. That'll be all. Okay, Headmaster. Make yourselves at home in the halls. All right, on the left training room. Go there tomorrow morning. Love this place. This thing here, we're not going to come to your quarters and the dormitories. Right. Pick a bed aligned to you. Okay. So we want to go left in the morning. Don't go that way. Today. Oh, hello. Who are you? Good hold. Yeah, tell me about it. I always feel old. Don't worry about it, villager. Oh, here's the dormitory, I guess. So, here we can. Save. Save. Yep. Yeah. Override. Love job. Got here. Ooh. Bunch of old books. More old books. And even more old books. Fantastic. Was there anything we missed up here? Sewing basic book. We're going to need those. If I see a moon, I see a sort of sun thing. I see beds on this side, I see beds on that side. And I see, is this like a, what would you call it, like a lathe or something? What's this? Make the bed. This bed is for you, for me. Let's find yours. Oh, it's coming we're on the wrong side. Oh, because they've got red sheets. And blue sheets. Makes sense. Oh, let's go to bed. Why not? Sounds replenishing. Righty. Do some training. Morning, fellas. That's sweet. Ah, oh. are you ready for training? Oh. Here we go. We're ready for training, right? Training sword. Training staff. Yeah. Whenever I play this sort of game, I always end up being someone that has a sword or a shield and that kind of thing very rarely go for kind of magic staff, that kind of thing. Rapid. <laughs> up, down, up, down. I'm not controlling this at the moment, but it's just doing its thing. But yeah, I always end up overcomplicating it when I try and do any sort of magic or wizardry. Um, so for example, playing Baldur's Gate 3 on my PlayStation right now, and yeah, I am so bad with all the spells, I just run around just hitting people with swords and not doing very well. But I think here we're going to try and stick with the staff and some magic, see how we get on, at least to begin with. Sorry, what? Um, she's waiting outside the academy. I was listening. E. Ooh, I'm guessing down. She is Erlina. Yeah, we're ready to learn some magic. Feels as if something was scratching an itch from far away. Um, yeah, compel it to come closer. I almost had it. Alright, train. Ah, 
a race. Go its current passing in front of you. One, three, one, two, three. Wow. Oh, we did the hot bit. Nice. We are absolutely smashing this training. Doing really well. Now what the headmaster teaches you is your life and uh oh. Is. It's time to try out the sewing kit. Let's do it. There it is. Look at us go. In a magic piece of fabric worthy of the very stars. Well, let's do another thing. Well, I'm bored. <laughs> Around a bit, are we? Fair enough. Where should we go? What's that sewing basics thing? I guess she wants to head outside. Hello? In that flesh mancer. By the great eagle. Sounds badass. It's over. First eclipse. It's for cleansing. Okay. Interesting. So the training sewed for days and months. Hit the worm. <laughs> faster. Do the worm faster. Whoop whoop. <laughs> oh no, we're starting to do some magic. Okay. Back up, meditating. Where a dweller is left to the stronger it gets. I don't grow for too long. Body or in your hands. I do enjoy how when they're talking something. It was like in red. So like dweller was in red. Dwellers are immune to magic. By cleansing the form. Total eclipse. So total eclipse must be a good thing. Three. Senses are exposed. And dweller. The dweller of what? Flesh Mancer with other seeds of evil. See. Weller of the Oh. Happened with a strife in my Yara. Guessing, yeah, that's gonna be the big big boss that we have to take on, maybe? Come on. A few weeks later, sound of the night. Up Zale. Oh, okay. Go quick save job. Very quick save job. So I wouldn't put you through it if it was like one of those where you have to save and sit there for like two minutes while it does this thing. That was this way. goes there. Oh. This. A note. It's from Carl. Reading this probably means I got caught. Oh. Cookies. Everything I can to be ready. Graduate. In the meantime, doing well. Ooh. Is Carl going to come with us? Uh oh. Okay, like 
friend to the end of time. Garl, what an absolute ledge. He is the best. No, he survived. That is okay. Wow, what a view. Great view, great cookies. Garl was here. Great. Knowing how a base smiled it away the next day. Ah. Oh. Never say something good for the elf. Oh, back to train. Isn't he is? <laughs> they trained and sewed some more. Big people. <laughs> you can do press ups with one arm. Oh, damn. Oh, the little learning screen's only got two of us now. Garl was there as well. Gone. Oh, there we are. Sewing things. Right. Let's go see the headmaster. Up and away. Here we can go. Oh no, he's still outside. Thank goodness for that. Hello. Thinking of my... Yeah. I know what's sewing. Cool. Time for the... Leave the journey in the mist. Challenge. Hey, it's our friends. Alina and Burgraves to review the basics of combat. We're gonna have to fight them. Yeah, sure. When enemies prepare spells. When enemies prepare spells, learn to read. Simpler spells will only what's excellent. So you break this one. Back. Oh, so that is what symbols are. I see it now. Now the symbols are gone and it's broken. You did wonder what that was in the last episode. You can control your projectiles now, so let's give it a shot. Moonerang. Press A to deflect. Oh, like tennis. Oh, I'm sorry, I was just getting into that. This <laughs> little school music. Uh, okay, well, let's go. Some ball. Let's try that again. Hold A for power. Oh, that's a lot of power. All right, now we're getting it. Now we're getting it. attack for now. Here we got three MP from that. Sure. Hesitate to use spells when MP bounds. He has to experiment. One last thing. Breaking the spell. Build combo energy. <laughs> Combos cost no MP. Solstice, solstice. Cool. All right. I'm sure, we will definitely remember all. Right. <laughs> well, thanks for the lesson. Cool. Ready to go with the basics of magic. Um. <laughs> uh, sure. What are we doing? Cycle through the characters. My members can use their learn in order of your voice. Okay. 
for now. Focus paramount. Proper time and you can increase the damage you deal. See it. Press A as the hit connects to increase damage. A. Wow. See that again. Then I think. Okay, so we need to remember that. Don't worry about it too much. Now timing your blocks. Oh look, he's cool. Proper timing, you can reduce the damage. Great. Press A as a hit connects to I don't think I did. Too soon, okay. Wait. <laughs> I knew it was. That's more like it. Yeah. Beautiful. Hello. Patterns will be harder to read. Basically, timing. One more thing. Okay. Oof. That was a lot of damage. Switch to defensive mode. Okay. One KO star is removed at the end of the round. Okay. Fight and survive until. Oh, we got that as well. Oh, we got that one. Now he's good. Okay. I'm learning. <laughs> Does that make sense to everyone? We good? Ready for the final test? Not yet. Might need to learn some more. Did we learn about the basics of math? That's what you taught us. Oh, it was. But there's only a thing. Oh, looks like we're doing this again. I'm just gonna push A like loads of that. Yeah, 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 yeah. We already know this. I've made a mistake. I the last thing. You. <laughs> right. Yes, we are ready for the final test. Let us begin. Us versus Headmaster. Big day. Here we go then. Speak our vows now. Press sale. One. So that I may use my agility to cleanse this world and protect my companions, I will enter the world as a blade dancer. I chose the curved blade under my speed or reflex. Hog on blade. There. Turn. <clears throat> right, ready? So that I may use my strength to inspire hope and eradicate evil. Um, a battle monk. Staff. Break. It won't break. Uh, how hard I strike. So cool. Oh, final challenge awaits. Left side, okay. Oh, it's here. Ooh, tomatoes. Take the leap. Okay. Just go for it, why not? Oh god. And it's saving. Perfect. Well, folks, we've taken the leap, we've done our training. I think that's going to be good for today. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Sea of Stars with me. 
hope you guys have enjoyed. Like I said, a little bit different, but hopefully a good change. You guys enjoyed it. Let me know down in the comments if you did. Leave a like on it for me as well, so that I know you guys are enjoying this. And I will see you next time for some more Sea of Stars. Yeah, subscribe if you want to keep up to all that good stuff. I'll see you very soon. Bye-bye.